One of the things that guests ask me all the time, uh, how close are you to the beach? And I don't have you know, a quarter of a mile. I mean, of course, there are big beaches a mile in which direction, to, all the way to Race Point in Provincetown. Uh, but quite honestly, if I get eight to 10 people a year that actually go to the beach, and they charge for parking and stuff like that. We have a dozen bicycles they can bike down and stuff like that. We have beach towels. But family type of things, um, yeah, the beach is important. And uh, uh, there are beaches everywhere. Um, Craigville Beach down the two miles from here, uh, six mile beach and stuff like that. A lot of us on private property, but uh, uh, it's a beautiful beach. It's a big, you know, horseshoe type shaped thing. And uh, quite honestly, I think you'd be happier there if you're 12 years or younger. Uh, you go out to the National Seashore, which is out in this part. And the, the Cape was originally a terminal moraine from the glaciers. And so all the beaches here are flat as a pancake, but you get out toward the National Seashore and there are dunes and there, there's good surf and stuff like that. And uh, there's some super beaches out there. And each of the beaches have, you know, little snack bar type things. And, and there, there's, so there's something really in almost every town uh, that have good beaches. Uh, I like the ocean side. Another beach here in town is Calmus Beach at the entrance of the harbor. Uh, it's got the same sand and water as any beach, but it's the only place on this side of the Cape they allow parasailing and windsurfing, so you get a show, and it's the harbor, so you see the ferry boats go by, excellent fishing there. Uh, and speaking of fishing down in the harbor, I, I get if I get one person every 10 years that goes fishing, uh, but there, there are boats that go out, the High Line has some, and there's several of them, uh, that go out basically twice a day. They'll go out at, like at 7, back at noon, out at 1, back at 9. And there are some more expensive ones that go out for the whole day. Of course, you can charter a boat. Uh, but but there's, there's tons of good fishing around here. It's where, it's where the fish that all the local restaurants and the lobsters and everything else come from.